Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Okay, today we will continue our the last subject about enterprise asset management setup. Now we will start from enterprise asset management data definition. Start from define asset group. Now login to application. Go to enterprise asset management responsibility click this one navigation is asset and asset group okay choose the organization em1 The asset group created is required during asset number creation. So we have to define the asset group before we create the asset number. Now define the asset group it contains description asset group description choose the template asset group the serial generation we choose the free define which is with three kind of type no control predefined and add receipt we choose the free define static prefix we put the pt equal test and then starting number we put 001 and then save okay the asset group has been created now each and every asset group created will be considered as item in inventory module for the particular enterprise asset management organization for check the item in inventory go to tools item details look here the asset group is created as the item in inventory but the difference is user item type use as a group and the asset management item type and asset group and go to organization assignment we have to assign the item or the asset group into into enterprise asset management organization like this em1 system maintenance is assigned okay that's it how to define the asset group and next we have to define the area the navigation go to setup choose the area and we can add the new one like we add s Yes. and then set okay the area has been created and next we have to define the department how to set up the department the navigation is go to set up routing find the routing and then click on department enter the department name and then save we create the test department okay this test part and then save the department has been created now we have to define the resource 
the navigation is still on the setup routing and click on the resources now we have to define the resource name Thanks. labor person resources type person just type there is for type menu payo receive payo move and wip move we choose the menu go to cost it we find the absorption count this as you need you find the count as you need okay and then save before we close the resources form we have to define the employees resources go to employees in the same form we have to choose employee and add employee to the resource choose the employee whoever you want to assign into the resource choose the employee from list of value just define as you need and then set the employees resources has been created and now define the department resource close the resources form go to department first query the already created department test go to resources add the resources that we have created before to the department test the board find the unit and then set in the same form we have to define the resource instance go to instances enter the employee name and number now this one and, and then save the resource has been assigned into the department okay for the next setup we have to define the asset number the navigation is go to asset find the asset number and then click on asset number okay we have to define the asset number's name yes. asset number. define the asset group that we have created before the item is pickle test okay. pickle test the asset serial number has generated automatically that we set up the asset group as predefined in the prefix vt and 001 ensure the organization is the enterprise asset management organization now choose the owning department test department choose the WIP counting class maintenance work in process counting class the asset status as created and define the asset type as capital if you create the capital asset number and if you create the reviewable inventory asset number we have to choose this one and now we choose the capital and then set okay the asset number has been created and now we have to define the activity 
What is activity? Activities provide us with a standard template of job which are applied to work orders such as routine or preventive maintenance. After these activity templates are created, they are associated with one or more asset numbers. So we have to create the activity to associate it with the asset number and asset group. The navigation is go to activities and click on master activities. This form is master item, but we can create the activity from the master item. Go to tools, copy from, find the activity template. This one, apply, and done. Now define the activity name like oil change test. Coffee with description and then check the user item type as asset activity, the asset management as asset activity, the inventory default as the template, and then set. Okay, after that, we have to assignment the asset activity into organization enterprise asset management we choose the em1 as set to maintenance to assign the activity and set the activity has assigned it into organization em1 okay we have created the asset activity and now we have to define the activity association after we have defined asset group asset and activity we can associate the activities with assets assets are associated with activities before entering the activity into a preventive maintenance schedule the navigation is go to activities find the activity association click on the activity association find the activity the activity is oil change test okay the asset type is capital we define the asset group to associate with the activity asset group is vehicle test this one and the asset number to associate with the activity is test asset number vt001 and then save the activity association between asset group and asset number has been created okay next we have to define the asset bill of material how to define it we go to asset and then find the asset bill of material okay this form is bill of material form in the item field as shown choose the asset group for which you want to create bill of material we have to choose the asset group like pants and then we create the bill of material for the item asset group click the item sequence find the component and the component the component from item is vehicle motor oil one the component serial effectivity and the one SO component details material controls order management okay and next component 
we have to do uh, we have to choose um, shop right for cleanup and effectivity and Okay. When the all details entered, we have to save this form, and the asset bill of materials has been created. Okay. And the next setup, we have to define the maintenance bill of material. How to set up maintenance bill of materials? Go to activities find the maintenance bill of material okay in the item field as shown choose the activity for which you want to create a bill of material the maintenance bill of material is created based on the activity defined already so for the maintenance bill of material we have to define the activity item and the activity that we have the people oil change test this one and then enter the component but component for oil change test we have to define it beaker uh, motor oil component one that effectivity is 14 October 2020 we can add the new component right. so, right. and then set the maintenance bill of material has been created and what next Next is we have to define maintenance routing. After we create the maintenance bill of material, we have to define the maintenance routing. How the navigation? The navigation is go to activities and then maintenance routing. We click on maintenance routing. Choose the item from the list of value. The item. The item is oil change test activity items alternate is no go to main tape define the department that we has been created before test the effectivity 14 October 2020 WIP description associate with the resource go to operation resources and we have to add the resource that has been created before test mobile we have to define the reset to the end point five then set okay okay that's all about enterprise asset management setup okay that's all about enterprise asset management setup if you like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe our channel see you in the next video and bye bye